Welcome back lottery fans and if you are a Powerball player or a fan of the Powerball lottery you're going to want to see today's video because in today's video I'm going to be showing you a lottery strategy that will greatly improve your odds of winning a prize in the Powerball lottery drawings. As we all know the jackpot right now is up to $277 million. That is a lot of money and someone out there is either going to win it or going to win even more if it rolls over. So you're definitely going to want to go ahead and see this. Uh, and as always we've got our scratch off ticket that we're going to do at the end of this rundown. So definitely stay tuned, see whether or not we win on this scratch off ticket. I am now currently uh, one for seven in terms of scratch offs. I've only won one time out of the last seven tickets we've done, but we're doing one of these after every single rundown and hopefully my luck will improve. Maybe today will be it. We'll have to see. So we'll leave that to the side there and we'll do that afterwards. But let me go ahead and jump in to show you what this strategy is. Now this is a, uh, a rundown worksheet that will work for any pick five lottery. So it'll actually work for the Mega Millions as well as the Powerball or if you have any kind of pick five lottery in your state or your country, you can use this as well. And you can get this rundown worksheet from lotterypredictor.com. It's in the resources section. It's completely free, download it. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and get this and download this and use this yourself because uh, it, it's got our wheel on here. And that, that's the critical thing here that's gonna increase our chances. It's the wheel. And a wheel is a way in which we can take uh, more than our standard number of numbers that we would play and arrange them on the lines as such that if any of those numbers come out, we're guaranteed to get those numbers on our lines. Uh, so this wheel in specifically is what's called a three in eight. Uh, so to give you a little bit of a rundown of what that actually is, what it means is we're gonna pick eight different numbers here. And that's what this box is on the top here. Uh, and uh, we're gonna then lay those out on to eight different lines down here. And then the way it works is the way these numbers are laid out, if any uh, any three of those eight numbers come out in the lottery drawing, then you're guaranteed to have a winning ticket on here. Now, it's not a jackpot winning ticket. It's a winning ticket in terms of uh, you'll, you'll get three of those numbers uh, on there. So that's the way in which uh, this works. So let's go ahead and jump into it. I'll run through this uh, and you'll see how it is. And we're going to be, I'm going to go ahead and using one of the features on lotterypredictor.com to actually pick our eight numbers, but I'll get into that in a second. So this is going to be for tonight's drawing. Uh, we are on the 11th of January, so 111. Uh, that's actually very telling right there. If you followed some of my previous videos around angel numbers, you know we just did one for 111, which is an angel number. Uh, so go ahead and maybe if you're into angel numbers, go ahead and check out that video and look at the rundown for that as well. But this is going to be for the Powerball Lottery. Now, if you go to lotterypredictor.com, one of the things you'll find on lotterypredictor.com, as long as a whole bunch of other great stuff, uh, is if you go to the Powerball section in the menu, oops, if you go to the menu, uh, you go to the Powerball section, there's all these different features here for the Powerball. One of them is the hot and cold numbers. Now, the hot and cold numbers are basically a statistical analysis of the last year's worth of drawings. And what it does is it shows you, uh, for the last year, what have been the most frequent numbers drawn, which are the hot numbers, and what are the most least frequent numbers drawn, which are the cold numbers. Now, the last rundown we did, we used the hot numbers. So today we're going to go ahead and use our cold numbers. So these are the numbers that haven't been drawn in a while or have been drawn the least frequently during the last year. There's, there's a statistical algorithm I put to these numbers to generate the hot and cold. But we're going to use the cold numbers today. So for our eight numbers, we're going to pick our, our eight most popular cold numbers, uh, which are these ones here. So we have a 13. We have a 58, we have a 33, we have a 40, we have a 9, we have a 69, we have a 34, and a 47, like so. Now, we fill these in, in these boxes. You'll notice each of these boxes is numbered with a separate number, 1 through 8. And on our wheel down here, you'll see different numbers one through eight as well. The idea being that for each line, what we're going to do is we're going to take each individual number, look at the number in the box for it, and put that on our line here. So we'll start with this first line, we've got a two, three, four, five, seven. So we need to get two, three, four, five, and seven from our chosen numbers and put them in our line. So two, we have 58. So 58 is our first number. Three, we have 33. Four, we have 40. Five, we have a nine and seven we have a 34 like so 
Next line we have 1, 2, 4, 6, 7. So we're going to need the numbers from 1, 2, 4, 6, and 7. So that's a 13, a 58, a 4, sorry, a 40, because that's box number 4, a 6, which is 69, and 7, which is 34. Next one is 1, 4, 5, 6, 8. So we've got 13, 40, 9, 69, and 47. And then you just keep going down, filling out all of these numbers based on the box. 3, 4, 6, 7, 8. That's 33, 40, 69, 34, and 47. 1, 2, 3, 5, 6. That's 13, 58, 33, 9, and uh, what was the last one? A 6. That's 69. 2, 5, 6, 7, 8. That's 58, 9, 69, 34, and 47. 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 13, 58, 33, 40, and 47. And then finally our last line, 1, 3, 5, 7, 8, is 13, 33, 9, 34, and 47. So these are the eight lines that we can go ahead and uh, play now in our lottery. And then the idea being that if three of our numbers are drawn of the eight that we chose, they're guaranteed to be uh, on this line actually here. So there you go. There you have it. This is, uh, as I said, you can download this lottery wheel rundown from lotterypredicts.com. It's free. Print it out. Fill it in yourself. Uh, and you don't necessarily have to use the cold numbers or the hot numbers. You can pick any numbers. If you've got a set of eight numbers you want to go ahead and use, uh, definitely use those. Uh, the trick to this is less about the numbers you actually choose, more about the way in which it lays it out to maximize your odds of actually getting uh, a winning. So in a normal drawing, you'd have only five numbers that you have the opportunity. This expands it to eight numbers. So it really greatly reduces your odds of how many numbers you actually have to hit to get a winning number. And hopefully, you know, if, uh, if you get lucky and all five of them come out here of, your, of the eight you've chosen uh, and you get that powerful number you're going to win the jackpot and that 277 million dollars which would be fantastic definitely leave me a comment down below uh, if you win the jackpot i'd love to hear that but uh, actually don't do that if you win the jackpot keep it to yourself don't tell anyone that's my advice all right let's go ahead and do our scratch off card now we have got an illinois lottery monopoly card so these are brand new they came out just a few days ago for the illinois lottery it's a two dollar card uh, went up to $25,000. We've got 2x, 5x, and 10x multiples. And you can enter to win a chance of 1 of 10 trips to Las Vegas if you go to uh, the Illinois Lottery website. So maybe we'll go ahead and do that as well, just to increase our odds. It's a standard card. It's got two winning symbols. We'll scratch those off, and then we'll scratch off the hats. And if our symbols match, we're going to go ahead and win that prize. So let's scratch off our symbols to start with. We're looking for a safe and a go sign. Now this is the second Monopoly card I've done. I did one in a previous video, didn't win on that card. Maybe this one will do it. It's number 55, so uh, who knows? The double fives may work. All right, our first one is water. We don't need that. Some coins, would it be nice to have some coins, but we don't, we're looking for a safe and a go. We've got a train, we've got a shoe, nope. Onto the purples, a crown, and a bulb, nope, the blues, we are getting a diamond, and a bank roll, a roll of notes, nope, nothing there, last two then, all right, down to the yellows, necklace, nope, last chance, and a missed monopoly, so no winner there, that's a real shame. One for eight, we're still on our losing streak again now. Uh, who knows, maybe tomorrow's video uh, will break that for us. Definitely make sure you subscribe so you go ahead and don't miss out on any of these. If you're playing the Powerball, uh, definitely good luck tonight. And even if you don't win the jackpot, definitely make sure you check your tickets because uh, literally there are hundreds of thousands of people winning every single drawing because there's, you know, there's lower prizes that you can win and everything like that. 
All right, that's it. I will be back later on uh, with some more Winning Rundown videos. I've got more Angel videos coming up. Uh, probably going to be doing some more horoscope rundowns. Uh, that's a new thing I'm trying to bring in this year, so definitely keep an eye out for that. And if there's a suggestion for something you want to see me do on this channel, uh, definitely leave me a comment down below. I'd love to hear your feedback to see what you like, what you don't like, what you'd like to see more of. But in the meantime, good luck, and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.